as a lot of you guys know, I do graphics and stuff. I'm still fairly new, so whenever I learn a new thing, I pretty much design with that new thing I learned for like forever after. So someone asked me to teach them how to be good at graphics, but I don't know exactly how to teach someone to be good at graphics. So I thought I would start doing little tutorials when I learn little things. So what I'm going to be showing you is like this little effect that I used here, like you see this 3D effect. I'm going to show you how to do that and it's very easy see i just googled a picture um i want to change her to like black and white so command u on mac or control u i believe on windows and change the saturation down to negative 100 and click ok now you have that you can duplicate the layer hit ok and we'll change this we'll rename it layer one copy layer two the screen's a bit laggy for me i don't know because i'm recording or what but anyway you're going to take layer one double click and this will pop up go to the advanced blending box right here and unclick blue and green and you'll have like this blue color and you're going to hit okay and then you go to layer two and you unclick the red box and it'll be red over here hit okay and now is the fun part. So you're pretty much done. All you do is hit. Make sure this movement tool right here is selected up in the top left corner. Hit shift and an arrow key and move it over. And you're pretty much done. And it is like it looks pretty sick. You can do whatever you want. And you can use like any colors. I'm pretty sure it would look sick with like any colors. Yeah, look how that looks pretty sick, but it's hard on the eyes. But yeah. That's what I wanted to show you. So if you enjoy this and like the idea of me showing you guys things that I learn as I learn them, I should give the video a thumbs up. Thank you for watching and I'll see you guys in my next video. I sound like a faggot, but whatever. Let's go.